In 2012, the Large Hadron Collider in Switzerland made big news with the discovery of a subatomic particle called the Higgs boson. That discovery was a major step in understanding the origins of the universe, and University of Washington physicists had a key role in the research, including helping to build the collider's Atlas detector. It's a giant circle, and it accelerates protons to speeds near the speed of light. And there's a number of detectors around the ring uh, to detect the protons when they hit each other. This is one of them, it's called ATLAS. University of Washington works on various aspects of it. University of Washington created roughly a third of these sort of wedge-shaped white wedges here. Through either end come these proton beams. In the very center, they collide with each other and produce tons and tons and tons of different particles that branch out everywhere. And so all of the various components here are built very specifically to measure aspects of the particles that result from the collision. Two years later, some UW students got the idea of building their own version of Atlas, only a lot smaller, and using Legos. About 25 people, including grad students and undergrads, as well as a few local high school students, built the model over several days. It took a long time. It took three or four uh, sort of events, and maybe something like 50, 60 man hours. Particle physics is awesome. Detectors are awesome. They're super cool, not just from the engineering, as you can see from the Legos, but the fact that something this big, it's roughly to scale with one of those Lego men, roughly. Something this big detects something so small, it's smaller than the size of a nucleus of an atom. That should be awe-inspiring, I hope. It's pretty, right? This is the first time a university in the Pacific Northwest has built a Lego model of the Atlas detector. Shi Chi Shu, an associate professor of physics at UW, plans to use the model for outreach to inspire interest in physics among all age groups. Sweet, you guys are so cool. While the real Atlas detector is about half the size of the Notre Dame Cathedral in Paris, the LEGO's model is small enough to sit on top of an office desk. It's super fun and an awesome outreach opportunity. Still, Whalen says getting the model just right kept the students focused on their work. And the LEGO's turned out to be a very attractive element, he says, even for the graduate students. Kids like it, teenagers like it. I haven't met anyone who doesn't like LEGO's in some degree. And particle physics sort of traditionally is a little bit um, off-putting to people, but we think it's really cool. So we think with something like this, we can inspire kids and others to think particle physics is really cool too. The model will be on display in the Physics Astronomy Building on the UW campus, and it could be taken to events in places such as Seattle's Pacific Science Center. Eventually, it could be taken apart so that a whole new crop of students gets a chance to build it. Okay, yeah, you do. All right, there you go.